Today we're going to show you the surprisingly easy and inexpensive process of creating a model using the Roland MDX540A and the power of subtractive rapid prototyping, also known as SRP. Starting with a solid object and removing unwanted material, SRP has several advantages over traditional additive rapid prototyping, or 3D printing. SRP devices cost significantly less while producing prototypes with greater precision and better surface finish. Roland SRP technology gives you the ability to use a wide variety of real-world materials that are not proprietary. This allows you to create a model with physical properties that are virtually identical to production parts. It also provides you with a functional prototype. Let's begin by showing you how easy the SRP process is. We start with the model you created in your design software. Add the supports needed for milling. After you've finalized your model, save it to industry standard STL file format. Roland's easy to use SRP player wizard based software will walk you through the process of defining the material to be used and selecting tools for your model. Import your model and verify its dimensions. If you don't know what tool to use, SRP Player will guide you through the tool selection process by asking you a few simple questions. It will also ask you what shape material you plan on using. You select the type of material that you are using and the dimension of material you have available. SRP Player will select the appropriate tool to create your part. At this point, you can either edit the parameters or create the toolpath. While SRP Player is generating the toolpaths, let's load material. This is easily accomplished with a rotary access unit. Load your material into the clamp. Create a small pilot hole. Insert the live center to support the material during cutting. Your material is now ready to mill. Once the toolpath has been created, you can preview your model and see an estimated cutting time. Select Start Cutting. Confirm tool size and install tool. Or if you have an automatic tool changer, simply install the tools in the tool holder and place in the magazine. Next, set your X origin at the position shown. The easy to use handy panel simplifies this process. Press Start Cutting to begin milling. From here, the Roland MDX540 takes over. It will automatically select tools as needed. The process begins with a rough pass to remove large amounts of material. This is followed by additional passes to perform finer milling and surface finishing. The MDX will also automatically rotate the object as required. The time required to mill the model will depend on the size, complexity, and material used. That's it! Your model is now complete. Once removed, your model can now be used and put to work instantly. No sanding or smoothing required. Here's an example of the money you can save by creating your own prototypes in-house. Thank you for joining our workshop today. Remember, you can view our entire video workshop series and register for Roland University online at www.rolanddga.com.